Hey, yeah. there's uh, something neat that you might want to check out at the American Cancer Society Discovery Shops. Yeah, cool. you better get there before it's gone, though. Uh, Ashley Williams is alive to explain. Matter of fact, you should get there before I go and buy right? it all. They're beautiful pieces. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, hi guys, good morning. Absolutely, Court, beautiful pieces. But here's the thing, you have until June 1st to start considering if you want to get down to the Discovery Shop. So Cody, you might still beat people, but not if they plan on being there super early to wait in line for these exquisite pieces of artwork. Beautiful. We're talking about Japanese woodblock prints. Now, these are rare, and uh, if, if you don't know much about a woodblock print, you might not know that it dates all the way back really to the 1700s, and that's what we're seeing here this morning. Karen Yee, good morning to you. Good morning, hello, Ashley. Hello, hello. So big fundraiser happening. You're, these are going to be on sale, guys, on June 1st at the Discovery Shop. Um, uh, let's talk about how you got your hands on these pieces. One person One donated, correct? Wow. The whole thing. And we also have uh, materials. We also have literature, 1957 to 1980, that she started collecting all this stuff. Wow. And it's just amazing. Um, uh, this woodblock print is a pretty famous artist, uh, Toshi Yush Yushida, and he toured the U.S. and um, started doing woodblock prints yeah. that were um, more custom to the Western eye, whereas all the other ones were done earlier, yeah. and uh, they're more like Japanese styles, kimonos, uh, sumi wrestlers, and kabuki actors. Yeah. So oh, wow. this was pretty much a poster uh, that people bought. Well, not this one, but we had scenery. We have beautiful women and scenery. Um, this is yeah. this is really an interesting, and this is quite an exquisite print. This is a Hiroshigi, and he's another famous artist that yeah. we um, have. He, she collected. You know, Karen, I'm gonna I'm gonna take it back for a second because I want to talk about just the history behind uh, woodblock printing. A Japanese woodblock. So let's show people at home uh, really how this artwork initially originated. Well, uh, initially it originated as uh, maps and uh, books. And this is an example of a book hmm. that was printed uh, 1700, 1750s, and it was mainly in black and white. And then they started making posters oh, wow. and colored posters. When Perry came to Japan in 1953, yeah. they started a more colorful. Uh, and they were able to get European colors and uh, yeah. instigated uh, <laughs> colors into their prints. Yeah, it's, it's really cool. So what would happen to you guys is they would basically have the image and then trace it onto the woodblocks, correct? That's right. They put it. They'd have to carve the wood carver would have to carve the woodblock. They put the paper on top of it. They'd rub it on, and then the print would come up. Yeah. So oh, they wow. didn't have printing presses at the time, yeah. and they had to do it all by hand. It took two to four weeks to produce. A picture. Wow. And, and I want to show um, what you kind of considered as a postcard uh, before. This is really cool, guys. So we know postcards now is beautiful imagery, right? I think we all know that famous one from downtown Sacramento. Every, whenever someone comes to Sacramento, they get that same postcard. <laughs> well, before photography, guys, this is uh, what was sent when people would vacation and or visit somewhere. That's right. That and so they're cool. beautiful. And they're each individual small woodblock prints. And how you can tell, you can rub your finger on it, and there's a, a raised edge, so you can feel wow. there's a difference this is so in it. Great. This is so but great. this is a rare book. Okay. Uh, and, that's, Road. and that is also for sale, correct? Yes, this that is, is for, for sale. sale. Okay, so some it just depends on the price, guys. But some ranging from one seventy nine to highest. Maybe. Oh, even cheaper than that. Cheaper than that. Okay, so <laughs> we'll talk price in the ten o'clock hour, guys. But we're also going to show you the oldest woodblock print Ooh. coming up in the ten. So stay tuned because it's good. Okay. okay. And then Cody might wait in line at 3 a.m. on June 1st to get his hands on open, it. Open, open, Then you open, have to open, worry open, about open, him. Open. Right? Yeah. Those, those are, are so cool. So cool. Beautiful. Wouldn't it be neat to have one of those? Thanks, Ash. Well,